produced because of movement of ions from the bulks of the electrode to the surface of the electrode and this current is arising from the diffusion of ions and hence is called as the diffusion current id now there's a point where these ions will attain uh, will attain an equilibrium condition and that potential is called as your half po wave potential which is found at when the diffusion current attains a value of exactly half so for amperiometry amperiometry uses half wave uh, the diffusion current to measure the equivalence point of a reaction for example in amperiometry there are three types of graph that we can see that means the cases number one the tighter solution ions tighter solution ions are active now tighter solution for those who don't know let's suppose this is a conical flask and it contains our test solution this will be called as our tighter and the solution that is being added from the burette or any other species that will be called as our tight trend sorry this will be called as a tight trend and this will be called as a tighter or tight trend tight trend d and that ends with t so let's assume this case to be we are titrating pb2 plus ion with respect to some so42 minus ion now assuming only pb2 plus ions are conducting in the solution conducting that means you are taking a lead sulfate salt in h2so4 kind of solution so so42 minus will entirely become your spectator ions so this is conducting and this is non conducting so if you are titrating it at titrating it we are at half potential whatever the value you will have that will entirely exist for pb2 plus ion at the very start of the reaction when you are